What's up, rolling out? This is DJ Focus, Bullet Industry, Chicago, Illinois in the house. We here. Pretty much my history is, man, it's, it goes back, man. I'm, I'm, I'm considered, a, you know, old school at this point in time, man, with the youngsters, new generation. Um, been spinning for about 13, 15 years. Uh, turntable is, I'm a triple threat. DJ, if y'all don't know what that is, that's a master of the turntables on the scratch bases in the clubs and on the battle scene. So at the same time, you know, you've got a lot of cats that claim that they, they know the table's real good, but they don't show it too well. I mean, we talking like early 90s, mid 90s and stuff like that. You know, we had the groups, you know, in high school where we used to spin and you know, go to different little spots, parties and stuff like that. So you could say you had a lot of aspiring rappers. So I wouldn't say it was, wasn't popping, but as far as like a mainstream situation, it was, you know, scarce. So uh, pretty much how I got down to it is, you know, I just felt the music. It goes way even before I even knew what hip hop was. You know, I was buying LPs, you know, when people were buying CDs and stuff. I think what it takes from artists is not only a a new type of sound, but they have to, um, you know, I come from an art aspect as well, too. I'm a creative person, even without the music. I, you know, I dealt with architect architecture back in the day, uh, uh, but I feel like the artist needs to have like a, uh, a marketing aspect of themselves, not just, I can rap, you know, I can, you know, everybody can rap. You know, everybody can put two words together to rhyme, but at the end of the day, how you gonna market yourself to separate yourself from this group or that group? So I feel like an artist needs to be well-rounded, especially in this industry nowadays. They have to, you know, you have to be ready-made. You have to, the only thing the label wants to add or independent label or major label, the only thing they want to add is water, like a, you know, a ready cake mix or something like that. Just add water. They don't want to add the eggs and the butter and then, you know, all, all the other stuff that goes into it. Uh, right now, I got a few situations. I got a mixtape coming out in March. I'm gonna have, we still haven't worked out all the details yet, but we're basically looking to do like a multi-faceted, like dealing with a bunch of different artists. Uh, then I'm gonna do a feature mixtape with another artist. I'm dealing with Focus out of New York. He spells his name the exact same way. I'm also working on my not-for-profit organization called the Focus Foundation, which is finding outstanding kids in school. So be on the lookout for that. You know, we're gonna be doing things over the summertime in 09 and beyond. We're gonna be dealing with kids, especially in school, that excel in school, do a lot of good things in school. And when I was in high school, you know, we didn't have, you know, a way to expose our talents as far as hip-hop was concerned. You know, we didn't have graffiti. We couldn't do graffiti in the school. We couldn't break dance because that was foreign to them. But nowadays, you got kids in school that do have those talents, and they don't have no way to out, you know, basically have an outlet for that. So basically, from there, we're just going to, you know, find kids that got exceptional talents in school and, you know, get them together, get them scholarships, go to different schools. So look out for that in the future. Check it out. This is DJ Focus, Mr. Spinberg, Bullet of Industry, Chicago, all day, in and out. Thanks for checking me out on Rolling Out TV. We out.